Hello everybody, this is Misty Rain, just want to discuss some uh, AEW wrestling and WWE wrestling and the difference as to why I think AEW is going to surpass the WWE. First of all, WWE have always the same scripted um, genre same matches over and over and over again talent doesn't have the um, um, creative freedom to do what they want in the ring or say, say or say what they want on their in their promos they have the same um, they have the same commentators like they have Renee Young and Corey Graves on Baron uh, Saxton and and um Trash Thompson and so those are the only four um commentators they have for Monday and Tuesday for Monday Night Raw and for the uh, and for t- Smackdown the matches are the shows are dull they're boring and the pay-per-views that's coming up Sunday. They have, they have, let's see, they have Baron Corbin going against Seth Rollins, which happened, I believe, in the last pay-per-view, right? Um, Drew McIntyre, Roman Reigns, which happened on... WrestleMania, Lacey Evans, and Becky Lynch happened on the last pay-per-view. So it's like, they don't have fresh matches. Then they have, if they had, they don't have the brand split anymore, obviously, because if a raw, if a raw wrestler is going against a SmackDown wrestler for the SmackDown championship. Obviously, the the brand split is over. That's that's what it tells me. Um, now, as far as AEW, they have Jim Ross as the co- commentator, as well as they're gonna have Jerry the King Lawler, two of the greatest um, color commentators of all time, in my opinion. And on the next page. Or, or out pay per view. Um, it sold out in fifteen minutes. Tommy Brown. I don't even think it sold out. Then, the matches. They're gonna have Adam Cole, Adam, Adam Page, Hey Man Adam Page, against Chris Chris Jericho, for the AEW new AEW title, and. John Moxley will be facing Kenny Omega. Now, those are two of the greatest matches, dream matches, I'm sure people want to see. So, for those reasons alone, those are fresh matches compared to rinse and repeat matches that um, WWE is having. They're not, and in AEW, they, the uh, talent is able to do their own promos. And their own um, thing in their in the ring, they have it. They're allowed to bleed. They're allowed to, you know, basically they have the freedom to do what, basically what they want, you know. And um, that's that's what makes it up. That's what makes a, a product successful is to give the talent the freedom that they need to express themselves. In which the WWE refuses to do because McMahon is um, in the old mind thinking. He thinks P and fart jokes are funny. AEW is more serious. He's, they're, more, they're more geared towards the wrestling. And WWE is more geared towards entertainment, but ch- towards children, towards the PG era. And AEW is going to be like some. Um, TV 14, which is more a 
left out there. Kind of like, I will say, I, I think it's going to be more like, better than the Attitude Era. Better than, the, more like the Ruthless Suggestion Era. It's going to be, it's going to be more, more um, uh, aggressive. But getting more towards wrestling, in which the wrestling fans, that's what they want to see. They don't want to see so much entertainment as they want to be entertained as people wrestling. They're having good storylines that make sense. WWE, they just, they don't make no sense. They have no, the logic gap is not there. So that's why it makes, that's why AEW is going to make a, make it, a success, and it's gonna. And if the WWE doesn't change, they will overthrow, overthrow the WWE. Um, and Vince McMahon knows that AEW is a threat, but he tries to play it off like it's like it's not, but it is. And if he doesn't, ch- if it doesn't change, it, sooner than later. I'm, I'm telling you, he, they're going to lose all their fame base, all the talent, all the talent that's not used. It's going to be going to AEW to become a success like John Moxley has. <laughs> and Chris Jericho. Because Chris Jericho's been a success anyway. They couldn't ruin Chris Jericho. And uh, that's, that's why I feel that AEW... That's the difference between AEW and the WWE, and why AEW is already a success without even lifting a finger, and WWE is mediocre, going down, bleeding out every day, every week, more and more and more. If you have any thoughts down below concerning the difference between AEW and WWE, give me thoughts down below thumbs up my video and if you haven't subscribed please do thank you for listening have a great day